Hi all, so basically we've got up to my perfume collection really quick. Apologies for the whole thing. So we have Casa Murati Dolce Amalfi. So this is a nuclear, what was it, um, it's an angel but it's, uh, I think it's angel ring, I haven't used it in a while, excuse the dustiness, okay, we have this, this is Olympia, uh, I think it's a legend, it's a legend, yeah, I like it but it's it's not working for me, it's like a rock hate relationship to be honest. Um, I wanted the intense and I ordered this by mistake. And I tried to use it as you can see, it's not working. Okay, next is this. This is a. Uh, a Ram is a Ramblin, yeah. Ramblin, I don't know the name. I forgot. It's quite nice to be honest. Uh, used to love it before and then for some reason I, I didn't like it and I haven't used it in like ages but it is nice and it's quite affordable um really good for the price okay this was just like a small present it's, it was like a little uh perfume no idea it's not bad it's quite like more like flowers a bit sweet not really my type but it's okay it was just a present then it's this uh, La Petite Robe Noir and um, these perfumes I'm showing now, these are like the old, old perfumes that when I first start like getting into perfume, this is like what I've, what I bought first. It is nice, it's a cherry perfume with bitter almond I think. It's okay, it's not my favourite, but it's quite good for the price, so I need to use it up. Then this, I forgot, uh, all the dust, we haven't been used in a, in a while. So this is Juliet Has a Gun Vanilla Vibe. So this is basically my first niche perfume. I can't even really say like proper niche, but it is niche for me because I've only had designer perfumes before. And this was like something more, like a different category. I was really excited. I thought it would be something special but it's not and um, it is nice but on my skin on the dry down is really salty so it's okay for the summertime i think men can use it as well maybe feel like that it's good quality but i don't know it's not worth it for me um i got it on like a I got it with a discount so i didn't pay the full price i would never pay the full price for this so okay next um, don't check about not giving the mom too. I don't like it. That's all I'm gonna say. That's why it's in a box. I tried to sell it, I haven't, and it didn't happen. So, um, excuse my voice, but I'm really tired, and I usually work on nights, so it's not a perfect time for me during the day. Okay, so this. As I said earlier, nothing really special. It's okay. I have some bunch of flowers, some sweetness. It's not long lasting. Just don't waste your money. The only one, like the, it's like a see through. And it's like brownish golden color. I think it's uh, not the intense one, not the black one. I had, I had all of them basically. Um, the caramel one, yeah. It's the same bottle, but it's like see-through, it's not red, the only one I think it's called. But not the intense, I didn't like the intense either. It was okay, better than this, but the first one was my favourite, okay. I don't know how it looks. Okay, let's move on. So I'm gonna talk about them together. Okay. 
So, Roberto Cavalli, Nero Assoluto. I love it. I like it. I need to use it. Um, it's different. It's unique. It's lasting, like quite long lasting. Uh, and for the price, you can't go wrong. This, on the other hand, it wasn't my favorite. I did like it. I did use it for a while. I have like a face, I've used it. It's, it's quite good. But it's just like the beginning, like the opening is not for me. It uh, smells in the beginning like a bit old school or like a, I don't know, grandma kind of smell. But it, it, it's just me. It's actually really nice. My sister has it too. So that's really good. And what do we have here? Oh, yeah, this is like an alien. It's almost like finished. I'm keeping the bottle because you can reuse it. It's like refillable. Alien bottle. Really good, really nice. I love it. I need to buy a new one. Oh, this is quite random. Really good. I'm scared to use it all because I don't know how I can get another one. My sister gave it to me. So, okay. And this is quite old as well. So, this is Gucci Rush, as you can see. Yeah, the packaging is not the best, but the smell is really good and unique. I love it. One of my face, but I, I don't use it because it's like almost finished and I need to buy a new one. But I'm scared. Oh, let's bring it back here. Let me put these back and then we'll continue. I know it's not the best setting, but I don't have many options. So, it is what it is. We're making it work. Okay. And by the way, this. This was expensive. It was cheap. I didn't talk much about it though. It's the 30 ml. Um, I still got like a deal on it. So, Vergeoff actually here because of Marathi. Why? It is like proper, proper niche. It's not for everyone. So, okay. Then another niche. Sorry for the dustiness. I apologize again. So, this is the Tiara Terency. I'm obsessed with this. It's worth every penny. If you can buy it, buy it. So, it's good. So, this is Kirke. It's quite popular. Everybody knows about it. Summer fruits, long lasting, uh, good quality, and people can smell you. Like, I recommend this instead of this. Like, save your money and just buy this. Obviously, if you want like a salty one, you're like, yeah, I understand, but this is much better. Okay, something that is unisex. This, really good for the winter, especially like winter season, cold season. I recommend this, as I said, it's unisex, in my opinion. Um, it depends what you like, but for me, it's it's fine. Like, it has a sweetness as well, so it's not, like, really hard to wear as a woman. So for me, it's perfect. Uh, Tom Ford, in general, is, like, my favorite. But the price point, that's a different story. Okay. This is actually just, like, a male perfume, but I think... They have, like, an intense version, I think. That one. It's more sweeter than this, so it might be like unisex, but this is really good. Like, really, really good. That's it. Yeah, I totally recommend. 